How was your uh, break? Lovely. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it was very restful. Yes. Did you take pictures? Did you do anything? I, the only the only significant thing was that I went to a cocktail party with Nancy Pelosi. Wow. Uh -huh. mm. And um, there I am looking. That's nice. She looks good. <laughs> and uh, she looks she, good. Yeah. Now she where are your glasses? Good. No, I know. For a second, I took them off stupidly. <laughs> um, and uh, and she she basically you know talked about things that we know already about how you know. She feels that um, it's a crucial, mm -hmm, a mm -hmm. crucial time we're in, that mm -hmm. our children's futures are at stake, right. that everybody has to vote, and that we've got to beat Donald Trump. I mean, right. basically, that mm -hmm. was what she was saying. Right. And everybody, you know, is like, okay, how do we do that, you know? And right. so Did we, she have the answer? Well, she believes, I think she, I, I, I infer that she believes that a moderate has a better chance of beating him than the uh, more um, radical uh, candidates. Hmm. So, you know, because she, because she pointed out that in the midterms, it's the moderates who beat uh, the Republicans in those uh, in Trump states. And so just based on that information, it would make sense, doesn't it? Oh. That that's what the country prefers. That. So I so hope she that we so too she far away happy. from politics. She was happy. She was happy. Her good. husband, you know, they're like. And you're them. happy. You yes. had a break. You look good. Thank you. Glasses are nice. Thank you. How's Bernie? How was your Bernie's your week? Uh, well, uh, not even your weekend. What's new with you? <laughs> <laughs> kind of the same old. Yeah. <laughs> you spent a lot no, of time. No, it feels so good to be back. I can see my feet. I can breathe. <laughs> um, babies you look are gorgeous. Babies are, thank you, you very much. And she's back to you. being skinny We're bitch so again. We're so spoiled here, though. We get, we get our hair and makeup done. Like, I haven't had that for three months. I know. So yeah. I, I, it's good to be back. Twins are here. You'll see them. Yeah. They're season 23's first guests. They're so beautiful. Ruby and William. So you'll meet them. Um, it was, you know what? I'm a new person since the last person I sat here. Yeah. Uh, the delivery, I was very lucky, but we ended up in the NICU for two weeks with one of them. She, her lungs were oh. developing. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, the nurses and doctors, as you know, I mean, you're just, yeah. you feel so, so thankful for yeah. them. Um, but I was going back and forth for two weeks uh, to feed William at home, feed Ruby in the NICU. Wow. And Megan, I talked to her every day, and you were such a help um, <coughs> Thanks, to get me through all of that. But yeah. um, I have such an appreciation now for, for parents that are still sitting in that NICU. Oh. Still hoping that their baby's going to be okay. So hard. Um, but babies are doing wonderful, and life is hectic. How and did... I drink a lot of coffee and a lot of wine. And uh, how did you have time to go to Russia? Then I surprised my dad in Russia uh, yeah. last week because he's he's finishing his job there. Uh, he was so surprised because he didn't think I would leave the kids and come all the way over there. But I will tell you, if you want to appreciate this country, if you want to feel grateful to be an American, spend a little time in Moscow. When you see that American flag waving on top of the embassy, all I thought was, boy, am I lucky. Mm -hmm. Boy, are we lucky. Because we yeah. complain a lot here, and we do have our problems, a lot of them. But you realize that the, we're still the best. The problems we world. have are about Russia. <laughs> right. It's true. it's true. And these are the Marines. So I spent a whole night playing pool with the Marines at the embassy. Oh, and that's uh, great. we don't talk about them in the media because they're not the headlines. Mm -hmm. But they don't see their families for two years. They're there making sure we don't go to war. Um, mm -hmm. And they really deserve all of our respect, as do all of the diplomats over there. Serving. It was a busy summer. What about you? Um, I spent a couple of, of weeks working because I have a new show coming out mm -hmm. on Investigation Discovery called Truth About Murder, um, October 22nd. Oh. Uh, is that the ID channel? Uh, on the ID on channel. The ID channel. On the ID channel. So I, 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 I had to still work. And then I spent a week on Martha's Vineyard with my family. And it's tr a tradition for them to um, jump off of the Jaws bridge where the actual Jaws movie was um, filmed. Wow. So they were just hurling themselves <laughs> off the bridge. That's my uh, husband, actually. Where are and you? that's my daughter. <laughs> um, I didn't do it. I'm very risk averse. So I was just Can worrying for everyone else. I don't swim well. Whoopi was supposed to teach me this summer. No, no, I never said I was going to teach you. I said you <laughs> need to take your behind and get taught so that you could jump off the bridge That's if you true. needed to. Because so if something's I coming know. at you on land and I know. all you can do is jump into the water. I know, I That's know. Not that's no, not you were, a good choice. Was, I was supposed to go to her pool and yeah. I didn't do it. No. But I'm going to do it. But I didn't do that. Um, and then I spent um, uh, a couple of days in SAG and I didn't see Joy this time. I'm um, sorry, that's around. SAG Harbor. SAG Harbor. For those of SAG you who Harbor. are not in the know. Yeah, SAG Harbor. <laughs> yeah. And um, I danced, actually, in Martha's Vineyard, I danced so much one night with my friend Regina that the bottoms of my feet hurt the next day. 
and then I couldn't feel like two toes. I was dancing so much and doing all of this stuff. Um, but were, I, you, I, were you sober in that moment? Not really. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> and then I spent time in Sag Harbor just really like <clears throat> hanging out with friends and getting recharged mm -hmm. um, and not spending that much time looking at the news. Oh, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah. It's there and then the when time. I plugged back in, I was terrified. <laughs> terrified. <laughs> How about you? Uh, I went to God's country. I was in the middle of nowhere, Wyoming, uh, fly fishing, shooting, doing all the redneck stuff you think I did. Uh, <laughs> that's me and my husband, and we had the best time ever, and it is just. I mean, spectacular. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, go to Wyoming. That's me fly fishing, having the best time ever. And uh, then I went to Vegas, because I can't go apparently a month without going to Vegas. <laughs> and I saw George Strait and Cher, yes. who was incredible. Cher and good. I was living my best life. And she's coming to Madison Square Garden. And I think everyone should, I mean, like, I was blown away. And I, I liked her music, but mm -hmm. it was more like, I was like, sure, who doesn't want to see Cher? And then I was like, oh my god, yes. it's fantastic. She has a lot of hits. Joe. I know she hates she my politics, but I like to show girls. <laughs> So, and George Strait was amazing yeah, too. Yeah, I cried. So, yeah. well, here's the great thing about what you do. People is, is that sometimes we can actually be friends yeah. for other reasons. Mm -hmm. We right. can love all kinds of yeah. stuff. So, that's one of the great things about us. I did Jack. Nothing really. <laughs> did you work? I worked for a day and a half. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, other than that, good. just hanging. Nah, good. Man, I'm, I'm so glad. Because you never sit still. <laughs> yeah. You're no, always doing I, stuff. I, I am always doing stuff.